Hey, it's Jeremy. Today I'm in Taganga, Colombia, kicking off BoundlessTraveler.com's new adventure series. Stick with me and we'll find out all there is to do. De donde vengo yo, la cosa no es fácil, pero siempre igual sobrevivimos. Taganga is a small town located in the Magdalena province on the Caribbean coast of Colombia. Situated on a bay and surrounded by mountains, approximately 3,000 people call Taganga home. Historically, the local economy was driven by fishing. Today, Tagangueros increasingly depend on tourism for sustenance. All right, before a big day of sports, it's important to get a good breakfast in. This is a very typical Taganga breakfast. Arepe de huevo, topped off with a fresh fruit drink. We're going to hit the dive shop in a few, so come with me. Taganga is an emerging hotspot to learn how to scuba dive. The majority of the dive schools are supervised by the internationally recognized Potty Dive Association. I chose the Vida Marina Escuela de Buceo because of their on-staff marine biologists and their dedication to preserving the integrity of the reef. Today's dive is in Parque Tayrona, one of Colombia's most famous national parks. Depending on the dive site, you can expect to sit back and enjoy about a 15-minute boat ride before getting wet. All right, I'm here with my friend Juliana Gonzalez, marine biologist that discovered the very first lionfish here in Colombia. Uh, Juliana, what are we doing today? What's the plan? Well, today we're going diving to hunt the lionfish because the lionfish is an invasive species that comes from the Indo-Pacific. So it's consuming all the small fish in the area because we have to control it to avoid spear fishing. All right, I've never been spear fishing, so uh, hopefully you can show me a trick or two, yeah? Okay. All right, let's no do it. All right, there's a first time for everything. This is my very first, not only lionfish, but first fish that I've ever caught while spearfishing. Uh, not much to look at, slightly larger than a goldfish, uh, but I'm still proud of my first catch. If you see here, I'm using a stick to stay away from the spines. The meat of the fish is actually quite delicious, but uh, if one of these spines touches me, I will most probably be in the hospital for the remainder of the week. So, I will avoid that. We're on break right now from our dive for second tank. So I'm just gonna take a moment here to enjoy the view. Have a look. I love you, Bob! Hola.
Hola, ¿cómo estás? Ah, bien, gracias. Estoy buscando cómo preparar un plato típico. Ok. Te recomiendo párrafo rojo acompañado con arroz con coco, patacones, ensalada. Perfecto. Ok. Bueno. A mostrar. Well, it seems like there's a pretty big commotion on the beach. The cameras attracted some attention and uh, they're calling us over. So let's go see what there is to see. We'll be back here in a little bit to eat. This is really quite exciting for me. I've lived in Florida for 10 or more years now and I've never seen a marlin. So much for Florida Marlins. We're here discovering the Colombian Marlins. Back to the food. That's the way to eat after a dive. Buen provecho, amigo. Gracias. So here we have a typical plate of what they would eat here in Taganga. Fried plantain, rice with cocoa, a little bit of salad, and a nice piece of fish. Guten Appetit. Let's go kayaking. After spending the morning spearfishing, let's check out how the pros have been doing it here in Taganga for hundreds of years. Alright, so we're at a beach here not too far from Taganga where they fish the same way they've been for hundreds of years. They've allowed me to take a look at their nets, traditionally known as chinchorros. These are completely handmade from wool. It's no small task as you can see. During the day, they hang out, play dominoes, cook, do what most friends would do. We'll try to pass a little time with them and see if we can catch something. Pasaste casi todo tu vida aquí, ¿no? Sí, es que nosotros pasamos el día en esta playa. Nacimos ah. aquí sí. y aquí morimos. Mm. En esta condición de que está el tiempo. A nosotros, a nosotros no nos interesa eh, el año ni nada. Estamos siempre, por tiempo. Sí. Ni domingo ni sábado, ahí estamos. Son lo mismo. Sí, fiesta, ahí estamos. Vamos a bueno. ¿Y tomen días libres algún sí. vez o no? No, a veces cuando uno un like, un ratito. Moment of truth, time to see if there's some fish in the net or if we waited here in vain. Maybe little guys, but they're sure strong as hell. He just told me that sometimes it's two and two, or two and one. I would hate to be the one. Ah. So there's a stinger here in the back. I don't know if you can see it. That's kind of what he's pointing out to us here. So, so far we've been able to catch everything that's inedible and or poisonous.
Watching sunset in Taganga is a local pastime, and there is no place more peaceful to do so than the middle of the bay. After sunset, the streets of Taganga are filled with artisans, acrobats, and street musicians. The surrounding artworks provide a treat for the senses and a unique background for the reformers and their antics. It's been a great day, it's been a good night, it's time for me to hit the road. I'll see you on our next adventure of BoundlessTraveler.com. In the meantime, remember the time is now, you're that person, and your adventure awaits you. So, come with me. <laughs> Stick with me. We are puta. <laughs> I'm, remember, time is now. You're that person. And your adventure awaits you, motherfucking machine. <laughs> <laughs> Uy, ¿está bien? Sí. ¿De cámara?